Can you guys hear uh, Grim in a weird way chat or is it just me? It's like Optimus Prime is talking to me. Wait, I'm gonna listen to my answer. I don't believe the stream. I I'm gonna listen to it myself. I don't wanna have scuffed audio. Listen to it myself. I don't okay, wanna have say audio. something. Say something. Wait, okay, say audio. something. Okay, they hear you fine. I don't know what's going on. So first thing we want to show is like, um, check the dungeon journal because we, uh, I added all the new, oh, you have, uh, yeah, it's fine. Let's go with that. Let's go with that. What do I do? Uh, go to the raids, go to Vault of the Incarnates, mm -hmm. and okay. you're going to have this new button there. It's going to look a bit different for the other people due to a fact that uh, you have Echo Internal loaded that overrides this from Echo Raid Tools. Should I turn it off? But yeah, you can. Is it already on Curse Forge, by the way? Yes, but no. It's going to be during today at some point. Okay. You're yeah, going to yeah, see yeah. a new version. You just open your Curse Forge desktop app. Sure. You press the glorious install button and you're good to go. Oh, look, oh, it's there. That looks sick. A new yeah. logo. Yeah, there is a new logo. Obviously, now it's showing nothing here because you're looking for weak yeah, yeah. for this world. Yeah. But this is the one that should show you... Uh, there's a thing kind of weird here. Whatever. I'll it's figure it out. It's later or something, yeah? Yeah, it's... Uh, well, things. But now, if you... We made it a lot simpler Ooh. this time around mm -hmm. because people gave us feedback that something... They just... They didn't want to do, like, per boss things. They didn't want to just okay. do stuff. They just want one import. I have it all GG done. I'm ready to raid. Well, that's literally that button on the top right there. You just smack that button with Echo Voti. You can click it as well. Just don't click import. Scrape. I click it. Fuck it. Yeah. yeah. You click it. Ah, yeah. You, mm -hmm. Then it's just going to tell you, just import all. Bish, bash, bosh. No, no, no. I no, won't no. press it. Uh -uh. I'm scared. Okay. Yeah, you should be scared. I would be and, great copy uh, anyways. I could delete it. That's fine. And, um, yeah, yeah, okay. Just don't. Uh, and everything in that regard, you just import that quickly. Bish, bash, bosh. You're done. You have weak orders, all the necessary weak orders you need. There are some more specific custom ones that we included, but are loaded never by default because it requires configuration and most people didn't use those. So we decided okay. why even spend time on it. Yeah. Yeah. You heard it, guys. Also the... Bosh, just get the add-on. Yep. You go to Dungeon Journal and get it from the Echo logo. Yeah. Okay. Pretty nice. Works gloriously. Yeah. Anyways, this is easy. that mm -hmm. is that's regarding weak orders. That's like basically nothing major changed. Uh, and that's it. Things go right now. The right. primary feature of this release is the cooldown tracking, which is super mm. super cool. I Wait, already see it. it on your screen. Yeah, pop it. Fuck it. Pop it. There it is. Oh. I press on cooldowns. No. Okay. Oh, the things are a bit different than you saw it last time. Yeah. So you have a navigation on the left. If you click on those groups there, Ooh. we we split it out in a way where you can now modify. Like, you see how it is on the left side? Oh, you have your very groups. nice. Yeah, you can checkbox yeah. them. All right. No, wait, this yeah, is yeah. just to yeah. enable, disable. <laughs> wait, fine. Yes. I, mean, I, thought you could, I thought you could edit multiple ones at the same time for like the... Okay, you need to... That's it's okay. fine, calm down. one day. Calm down. That's version two, okay? That's version two. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming up. Okay. Down. Sorry, yeah. Yeah. All good. Now, we also split up the concept of groups and filters because filters are basically the thing that does the spell selection, right? What is being tracked in this group? Right on the left yeah. side, you also have filters. If you click that, oh, and oh yeah, that's mm -hmm. basically you're basically if you click one of them, you're configuring which spells you want to track in a group. Okay, yeah, super simple. Bish bash bosh, body body ba. Then you go guys. into your yeah. exactly. Now you go into your um, a group, and then on the spell selection, you just yeah, select you the select filter the you want to see, and mm -hmm. that's it. Now. The thing that we want to do is because I see that uh, your uh, dungeon setup is, I'm going to say demonic, but, uh, you know, it, it is it is fine. You know, we're going to fix it. Yeah. It's going to get fixed. But the first thing you want to do is because you don't want all of these to be loaded uh, in your dungeon, right? Because you don't want your raid week or as uh, raid uh, cooldowns being shown in dungeon, correct? I kind of do, actually. No, nah, you don't trust me. No, nah, no, nah, you don't. You really. Why? Okay. 
because okay. they're on the wrong position. Okay, we're gonna fix all of this. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I I don't. I I hated it actually, but it's just I yeah exactly to do it. good. Yeah. Correct. Correct. I saw you read the briefing. Good. 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 Anyways, mm -hmm. <laughs> now if you scroll at the bottom of that main panel there, you have mm -hmm. load settings. Yeah. So basically, what that does that's basically something similar to load conditions of weak orders, which allows you to basically just load those um, groups inside of the matching criteria, mm -hmm. right? So yeah. for your case, you would probably, I don't know how you want this, but you want most of them to just be loaded in the raid. That's my guess, in a raid group. Or solo, yeah. you can do that as well. Now that's the question, how you want to do it. I mean, I, I like to see them always, but... <laughs> I mean, you're gonna be... Then, okay, for the sake of uh, for the sake of testing, sanity, yeah, we say in raid, yeah, okay, yeah, we say in raid and solo, right? And you accept that in raid and solo, yeah. So okay, yeah, and now do that for every single one of them, like real. It's got uh, it should be on the groups. It's yeah. gonna be super easy because Maybe. the the thing stays. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that is true. Okay, yeah. it's already much better than before. Damn, this yeah. was. Uh, I went through some shit chat to be able yes. to from configure mine. Okay. I hope you appreciate the yeah. uh, easy navigation through these menus. Yeah. You can also see that there is like a different background to them a bit now. Yeah. Why Basically, is that? cut because they're not loaded. Oh, okay. Yeah. Right? We stole that idea from another yeah, idea yeah. that we. Yeah, I know. So it's pretty good. Mm -hmm. So now what we want to do is can we get like a group of people by any chance? Like an yeah, actual full group? Yeah. I'm sure. Yeah. The viewers are ready, waiting to join right now. Exactly. Well, I'm not the leader, so... Uh, I'll fix, I'll fix. You are now. Maybe I should... Uh, I am now? Oh, there we go. Uh, come join. Scribe. Hey, right, just... We need we need volunteers, guys. How many people do we need? Like three or...? Five. No, just, yeah, yeah, five. So we are a group of five. Okay. And do yeah. like a... Yeah, and give us, give us like a... God damn. Oh, we, we are three mates. What? Uh, we have different three times? mages. It's fine. No, it's fine. We're good. We're good. I can okay, kick. we're gonna yeah, have yeah. three different mage specs. It's fine. I'll get Jamonike. It's fine. Jamonike request. He, I, oh, I, I oh. felt him like going sad that he didn't get the invite. He was like, "Man, I did so okay. much." Yeah. Also, you managed to find one person in the world that doesn't have the. Oh, never mind. I, I'm extremely sorry, Jamon. You're good. Mm -hmm. Anyways. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So now what we want to do first, you want to set interrupt, right? Really important. Yeah. You are. Extremely liking, you didn't see a single interrupt, which was painful. Let me right? try to do it quick. Do I do I try? Yeah, go go for it. Try using it the quick. new UI functions. Okay, so I want to. Um, I would usually duplicate one of these and you, then edit it there, but I won't do it this time because I like to have my interrupts as bars actually. Exactly. As a weird guy, so I make a new group, tag. I rename it interrupts. Um. And I, there was, ooh, there's a, everything is tracked by default. That's kind of weird. Not gonna lie. Yeah, yeah. Okay, interrupts tracked. Glorious. Cool, cool, cool. It would be, be kind of nice if I could like just, just take it and stretch it. Obviously, that's a bit crazy with uh, the fact I mean, that you can yeah. do a lot of things with it. It's fine. Um, yeah. Set layout options, spacing, display settings. I feel like this is the width. Oh, that's good. Well, I hope mm -hmm. I can change the texture. It looks like I can. To the beautiful uh, minimalist. You're gonna find it. There it is. Oh, oh. Chad, it's happening some, live. Yeah. Do you want some border there by any chance? Like border might be. Yeah, I would like a border. Yeah, well then, then Where you is it? Take the border. I mean, I think it's if you scroll a bit it's down. I guess. Filter down. Oh, enable border. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. I like to have a border. border Use filter now. I just want to have a. Oh, there we go. I just like to have it black like this. Mm. There we go. Just there pop we go. it out that a little is... bit, chat. Yeah, just so you see it, right? But you also want some text on that, right? Because glow kind of... it? What does the glow setting do? Well, glow is designed for. Well, for kicks, it doesn't really make sense, but like for um, any stuff. cooldowns that you use. Exactly. Right? Ah, yeah. It can okay. glow the, the thing it was. Obviously, healer inspired because we all love healers in Echo. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. 
Mouse over tooltips is actually pretty cool because the way it works, it actually, mm. uh, it doesn't catch your mouse, right? So even if you have mouse over tooltips, yeah, I see. it will, you can click behind it. Yeah, yeah, I'm doing it right now, yeah. Yeah, so that's, I don't know, like, it's good. Yeah, uh, for for kicks it's kind of useless, but like for other things that you're not completely sure what it is. It's yeah, I will pop it on my. I'm actually gonna do it right now. Actually, I'm gonna pop it on the DPS cooldown stack. I think that's a good yeah. one. Tack. Sup. Done. Yeah. And I go Pretty back. Good. Wow, this navigation is so much better, dude. Chat. Yeah, I know. Oh, you don't. I have no idea what I went through to fix all my stuff. Okay, yeah. It it was painful. Okay, it was painful. This but went through iterations. It, it, yeah. This is iteration four or five. I don't even know. Anyways, now we scroll a bit to the bottom because yeah. we want some text there, right? Obviously, there's some text that is pretty important. Yeah. Now, Enable text. Uh, this is a spell name. We don't really care about the spell name you because, know. well, you want to disable it before you, you know. I want to disable there. it. You want to dispel spell name. Oh, you can display multiple it. things. Okay. Yeah, yeah of see. course. Of course. Yeah. So yeah. basically. I don't know if you want, like, what do you want there? Do you want the name? Do you want I want to the... use uh, probably class color. Mm, but uh, that one doesn't and, but really... Outline it. And then, like uh, that, really? With the class color at the bar? Uh, probably not, actually, right? Kind of yeah, looks, that's... looks weird. I feel like that's Why what I did in the sure? past, but I guess I didn't. Yeah. I don't know. So, yeah. do me a favor and fix the anchoring instead of bottom left. Do left, left. Left, left? What the hell? I mean, yeah. oh, like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah so it's nice. centered. Yeah, right. Yeah. I want to do That's that, much yeah. better. Yeah, you can now obviously do the, like, you can offset That's it, great. whatever you like. Yeah, this is fine. Bish, bash, bosh, yada, yada, yada. We go scroll up. Now, this is probably good for the what, unit what name. What is this? Name abbreviation? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I like that. Yeah. Yeah. So you can have, um... oh, wait. I realized that I don't that have a good. pick. But you can see now, as soon as I get my kick, it should auto-update. As soon as my pet gets summoned, please get summoned. Bomb. Wow, yeah, I did. Yeah, wow, we're not in glorious. the same zone, chat. We're just like, he's in China. Yeah, I, and I'm I am in, uh, actually in a different Africa. realm as well. Different realm? Yes, I am. Okay. Impressive, so, yeah. Yeah, it, it just works. Now, the next thing you want, you want to change the... You probably want the cooldown to be shown. Yeah. Is my guess. Duration. Which is the duration. Oh, duration, okay. Yeah. Yeah, charges Maple is a text. thing for some abilities that obviously have charges, but most of them don't, right? Yeah. Now, I would, what I would do if I were you, I would just add this right, something. right? Yeah, yeah. It... Yeah, I, I activated it, but. Uh, yeah, now, yeah, well, obviously now it's not going to I'll show. I'll go right with this, and right. Yeah, right, right. Now, there is a cool feature that we added recently because this was a problem. Basically, you couldn't see what's happening yeah. um, right now. So what you do is you scroll up, scroll up. There is under Please display. I'm fairly... Oh, yeah, that's a new display. thing as well. Yeah, let's go. Wait, uh, oh, me... there it is. Actually, it's under oh, layout. layout. Okay. You see the show test show displays? Show test displays. Yeah, I got them. Bam. So now okay. you can actually see how it looks when it goes on cooldown, right? Obviously... Yeah. There is something wrong with the uh, text. Yeah. Uh, right. Scroll duration text. Yep. Wait, it's, it's 0 0.2 uh, for preheat, but it's yeah, it be, for this one. Uh, you are anchored to the icon instead ah, of to the bar. Okay. Got him. Right. So now configure how you want that to look. Like you see the. Uh, how do I want it to look? I don't know. Say to remain duration under reach, the position will change. Five. Yeah, that's good actually. Yep. Yeah, definitely one decimal. If if you're putting two decimals here, you're just trying to be cool, dude. Like if you're playing like this chat, I I just don't believe that you're doing anything with this information. Uh, you, you do you realize that you called out like four people at Echo right now, yeah? Yeah, they're just hard trolling. They think they're like, yeah. oh, I can read this. Zoom, 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 zoom. Like, what is this number telling you, dude? There's no way. There is no I way. Mean, it's just I full mean, troll. So... One decimal. I is mean, good. Maybe the. Listen, maybe they're just younger. Maybe they can just process that information. Uh, you know? I, I, Did you I consider would, that one? I, the thing is, I was young before, so I know what young people can do. Mm, well, if you say so, I believe you. Okay. Yeah. So now you probably want an outline on that because that looks hideous. 
Yeah. Font style outline. Yeah, it looks better. You can or thick outline maybe. Thick outline is actually pretty good as well. Oh, I, this, is, know, this is not what I mean, I this like. is a Lordbook style. This is Lordbook style. Tobo also likes it like that. Yeah, Tobo he does. He likes his yeah, outlines, so. but not me. Yeah, I, I don't know. It's uh, spicy. But yeah, yeah. That's, that's basics of it. But then we realized, thank you, Echo Raiders. I love you so much. Then you realize that you want different things to happen depending on like the kick state. So basically, we implemented these things called states which is similar to conditions in uh, in Vigors. Vigors, yeah. right? So you have a state, let's say that it's like on cooldown or on active, if you go there. Yeah. Yeah, like CD active, that doesn't make sense for interrupt, but for unit away, that's a good one okay. Yeah. to test it. You want something different. You probably want alpha or desaturated or something. Yeah, I like to desaturate Alpha. those. Wait, what happened? Yeah. Oh yeah, here. Oh, I can yeah, add multiple can... things as well. I see. Yeah, you can you can chain like forty of them. The you see this? Ah, it desaturates the icon. Yeah. Yes, but okay, okay. not the bar. Yeah. You can also make it so click there, mm -hmm. and press bar color somewhere. Should be somewhere oh. bar color. Yeah, uh, bar color. Yeah. Yeah, and then you can modify it. Oh to yeah. Something else. So, yeah, this is uh, probably a bit darker. Uh, this is good. This means like you're DC'd. So, but you're I'll, so I'll, far I'll, that it is right now triggering, right? Yes. Yes, exactly. Like, yeah. uh, the difference is that we're in a different instance. You're obviously where nobody's next to you, right? Yeah. So, this is triggering, right? Mm -hmm. The thing that you see above there, you see this show unit in groups. That is actually just a scribe feature. Yeah. Because what happens in raids is that you have peoples in group seven and eight that are there that need to be there for reasons right yeah but you obviously don't want to see the cooldowns of this is not my... just a scribe feature really i've seen it even people in china that killed russa geth mythic world 15th while having people in group five and they don't want to track that. So I'm, I'm sure there are people here in the chat really? that have dirty radiators that keep raiders in the group. I don't like to do it because of these reasons mainly, but um, yeah, you can now keep them in the group and you won't track their cooldowns by mistake. But it's not a scribe mm -hmm. feature, right? Like there there are people in the bench. It's a scribe usually. feature. Yeah. We, we define it as a scribe. Okay, okay. yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So uh, in general, now what you want to do is you want to position this correctly, right? Yeah, I mean, like that. Type. It's super simple. You yeah. just drag and drop. Drag yeah, I usually drop, put it drop. like this, and then I put these right here. Yes, that is Gucci. pretty good. That yeah. is pretty good. Now, also what you might want to do, I don't know if you want this, you want mm -hmm. it to be sorted by who has the kick. Correct? Or you just want it <sighs> static. So what happens when... I mean, maybe? I don't think so. But maybe. I mean, I did watch. Uh, mm -hmm. I did watch a certain NDI team, right? And um, yeah, they are do they really at... know? Do they really know what they're doing? I don't know. I mean, I watched Gengo, and he has it sorted, and he's the one that's usually calling the kicks. So I think he's uh, pretty good uh, in that regard. Hmm? I don't know. Do you think you can do better, Yam? Think you can do better? I don't want to brag, but you know, I've been calling some stuff, and he was still in the gym. You know. Uh, uh, true, true, true. That's not wrong. Getting them gains. Okay. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, I mean, if that's all you want, that is all you want. What happens Pretty when, uh, like, the thing with sorting, what I don't like at all is, I wonder if, if you fix that, is uh, let's say kicks are uh, all ready, okay? And, mm -hmm. uh, like, it's sorting by a secondary uh, yes. thing, right? So let's say it's yep. a spell ID, and let's say my spell ID is the lowest, so I'm going to be at the top. Now, sure. I pop a kick. Nobody else popped a kick. And now my kick yeah. gets ready again. Does it put me again to the top, or does it keep me where I am? No, it puts you to the top. That would be yeah, like that, a... That's the thing I don't like, because then it leads to some swapperoo action. So I don't know yeah. if people like that. I don't like it. I, uh, I mean, that's why usually I don't how stuff. I saw... 
yeah, usually how I saw people using this is they um, they actually uh, sort it by um, like a readiness, right? The actual cooldown duration, right? Mm -hmm. Because you kind of want to know instantly which one is the next available. Yeah. But the way way that you want it would be like round robin, I guess. But how would that, for example, work? This is like me talking. How would that work if like I kick with a 30 second cooldown and you kick with 14, right? But I kicked before you. you. See the problem? Yeah, I think it's fine if it's sorting between the things that are on CD, but then uh, when things become ready, I don't want it to change things Swap anymore. Around. Yeah. Hmm. That's an interesting one. Didn't think of that one. Okay. People note. Yeah, maybe ask the MDI team. I, I don't know. Maybe that's what they want. Maybe that's like their deep desires that they just uh, didn't tell you. I mean, I mean, that could be the case. I mean, again, go question mark. But yeah, let's continue on because now we have interrupt, so you can actually see who is where. Can you come to Voldraken so it's not like out of yeah, range? It's not great. Yeah, sure. But yeah, now. Let me, now they're already. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah, I so, like to have yeah, the now, background black. I immediately notice that. Okay. Fix. Quick Can fix. I do that. Tag display. Uh, background color. Tag. Oh no, I edited something else. I think. All right. No, you didn't. You edited the correct one. Uh, but it's a It's the alpha on the right side. You see it. Oh. There was an alpha here as yeah. well. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That's Thank you, Blizzard. Don't I worry see. About it. Yeah. The add on yeah, definitely has zero problems, guys. If anything doesn't work, it's just a Blizzard's issue. Yeah. Yeah. Or user error. Okay. Yeah. Um, usually user error. Okay. okay. But is now this we have interrupt. CC, by the way? I see again. A yes, it is. You can actually modify that. If you go to the options, to you can... CC or Echo RT? Echo RT. You can. Th there is a checkbox somewhere where it says to uh, honor the omni blah -de blah -de blah I think that's uh, exclusively under the cooldown text because you're now modifying the the no, display text. settings maybe here cooldown yeah. numbers yeah mm, yeah that sounds like it yeah pop your CD I can do uh, this uh, and then I deselect this yeah and it's but it's not deselected for other things, right? I hope not. No, no, yeah, it's that's a good, per. That's good. It's for per the view. icons I want it's, to have it. Yeah, yeah of course, yeah. makes sense. Mm -hmm. So now you have your kick bars, glorious. Yeah, you can actually now play the key somewhat. So now you have, you have your interrupts, right? But you also kind of want to track some other things, right? You, I don't know if you want to track offensives of people. I usually don't because yeah I, I, i'm already doing it that's the way i am oh so okay right this is actually great because we can rapid fire this one okay? okay so this is what we do we create a new group no 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 okay new group no, no. new group what do you mean new group, new group. oh like we okay, okay. New... I, I thought like a new group in game not uh God. yeah yeah Done. first uh take this load condition party there yeah. Yeah. And now uh, call this, I don't know, offensive CDs or something. You sure Group I don't want offensive. to, you sure I don't want to duplicate this one, right? Or yes. Should I duplicate? I, I, no, you, you should. Okay. Oops. Uh, offensive CDs. Okay. Cool. Now go to spell selection and select that one that has like the untick all of these. Okay. I need to fix that. Yeah. The default, it's all selected. Yeah will be get fixed i Please, swear yeah thank you now select the offensive cds in your custom filters because you already have them uh i don't know which CDs, one those are dps cds probably oh it was probably using the pre-made filters is my guess uh yeah yeah i was using yeah it does filter. yeah i was just using this so yeah just so I, I have that no one. idea what dps cds are right now yeah 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 now mm -hmm. uh collapse that spell selection because we don't need that anymore that 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 thing is done yeah now go to layout and now press anchor to unit frames. Oh, you're doing some dirty stuff now. 
Anchor to we are the, okay. Yum, yum, yum. Okay, now we also want to get rid of the bar. Okay, okay, we need to do something here. Okay, anchor point here should anchor be uh, top right. Wait, wait. Anchor settings. Yeah, ah, I see. Top. Yeah. Right. Top no, right. Top right. Ah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Top, top right. right. Yeah. And there should be top left. Okay. Glorious. Now, uh, grow direction should be left. Okay. And I see it what should you're doing. be mm -hmm. for, I don't know, like just put it for 10 or something, something ridiculous. You see, grow left and then there's a oh, four. I see. So yeah. So it uh, never it goes keeps, into yeah, a second. Yeah. Row. It keeps growing. Yeah. yeah. I mean, one row exactly. would be fine. Okay, no, so fine. No, it's, right. yeah. the, the way I want to do it, I want you to have like a top row that are offensive CDs, and then you have the bottom row that is oh. defensive CD. Right? All right. So yeah. that kind of works good. Now you scroll down. This is all good. We need to get rid of the bar. That's the first thing we need to get rid of. Right? So if you yeah. scroll down a bit, down. get rid of the bar. Yeah, but now it needs to trigger. Okay, just change the size a bit. Yeah. Oh. What the hell just happened? Oh, I can do this, I guess. And I guess it needs to be size of the icon or what? Yeah, but the, the icon should grow. I'm not completely sure what the hell just... How did you manage? I'm impressed. That's right. It yeah, still yeah. thinks it's a bot, I think. I think that's what it's happened. Yeah. Oh, you're changing the width. I see what's happening. Okay, so you need to change the height. Because um, it's an icon, right? And the width and height should be the same. We kind of stopped doing uh, the thing where we're forcing the same width and height. So now you can do really demonic stuff, but it also kind of breaks some stuff. <laughs> you see what I mean? Yeah. But I mean, yeah, I mean, I have it right now. The selection yeah. is can, still Can you set it to place. less than 20? Like... Uh, yeah, Yeah, can. that's good. Set it like to something because... I think your. Do you know what your uh, unit frame width is? Like the height. Yeah, you want to have half, like, half of it, basically, right? Yeah, basically. Yeah. I, I think this is good. I think Nineteen is okay, great. Okay. Now, yeah. Now, just, yeah. Cool. I do now have we, really tiny frames. To be fair, I don't know if people do, use this. Yeah. I wouldn't necessarily use these in a party either. Do you want me to up them yeah. just for the sake of this presentation? Yeah. Yeah. Just increase them. This just is super tiny. tiny, tiny bit. Yeah. Yeah. 17 i think 17 is good or 16. 18 yeah. 18 is good 18 is good. okay so now the thing that i like i don't know if you like i like borders around the icons it has borders already right no, no i guess it doesn't no it's just on the icon right some sure. icons do some sure, let's don't. do it the way you like it exactly glorious so that's gonna uh, be uh in the display, display setting. enable border one pixel yeah, don't oh, you want to have filter. the class colors as well? Yes, yeah, yes, I, maybe. I, bet you do. I don't know. I don't, I, I, oh, don't bring it what? to zero. That covers the whole thing. <laughs> okay, that's a new one. Okay, I I wouldn't put it on class color. I would actually just put it on black. But that's oh, God bless. Yeah, that's what I would do as well. Yeah. 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 Actually, Glorious. It looks better. Yeah. Glorious. Yeah. Now the thing that we want to test is we want to test what happens if somebody presses a cooldown. Because I don't think you have the class colors there selected. Oh, it automatically does a range indicator thing as well, by the way, chat. Yes. Like uh, of, of grid. When I when people are far away, I have this thing. And, yeah. Uh, so yeah, that is because mm -hmm. it's anchored to the yeah mm -hmm. the grid frame. So whatever that frame does, this does as well, right? The only thing is because you modified now the scale, the things will not be like pixel perfect. The borders might be a bit off, but whatever. We don't care about that one. This is how uh, you want it to look regarding the numbers and everything. Um, yeah, yeah, I think so. Okay, now we do like a quick. You want to have it jibbe. one pixel lower? No meme. I think it's uh, one pixel off because there's like the spacing between my rate frames. Uh, so I do. I think that's because of the scale, but no, 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 no I be... don't think so. Or maybe I do, but it's fine. I mean, I can do it one pixel lower, or can I not when I anchor it? Yeah, you can. It's uh, it's going to be in the layout settings, is my guess. Yeah, oh, you guess. see the anchor point? X and Y offset. Oh, there. Okay, we minus one. Yeah, now it's perfectly lined up. Oh, it's saved. Okay. 
Yeah. Okay, we saved. Saved. Now, th this is basically how we want it to look, right? Mm -hmm. And now the glorious part, right? You go to the cooldowns, you add a new group, call it defense. No, you duplicate, duplicate this group. Yeah, yes, that's right. Yeah. Finally. Yeah. And now, now defensive put... cities. Yeah, exactly. Now you uh, basically spell selection. Tack. Exactly. Tack. But now you don't see it because it's overlapping, right? Yeah. But now what you do, you go to the layout, you do bottom right mm. to bottom. Bam. That's it. That's literally it. And then I need to up these a few pixels. Because right now it's... You uh, could, yeah. Yeah, because... Yeah, this is perfect. Yeah. And now you have offensive CDs on the top row always, and you have defensive on the bottom row. But sometimes you just, for some reason, you want to add a certain spell, right? That is yeah. also really simple to do because you can compound filters together let's say that for some reason you also want to see externals which is currently called defensive target spells you can uh, click it currently yeah. we don't have a class that has an external but it would just merge the filters together so you have like both things yeah i mean if we just grow here right yeah exactly correct yeah, yeah. it would just add, I mean, we can add just more do things to it. utility spells whatever you want attack correct yeah Bish, bash, bash, chat yeah, exactly. Bish, bash, bash. Now, you can take this to an uh, extreme level and create your own filters, which is something that you did for Raid, as I assume already. So if you go to the filter section on the left there. Yeah. Yeah, you can create your own filters and basically put any spell you want in there. So... I add, yeah. tag. Um, I type in uh, Curseforge. Ah, yeah, okay. that's not a spell. Punch. That's not the Atom Manager that you can download this Atom from, boys. Uh, exactly. Yes, yeah, so how do I, what do I... Okay, I put another spell. Let's say... Pah, let's get exotic here. Okay, Is Dragon that... Rage. Dragon. What's Dragon Rage? Dragon Rage must be an offensive. Right. Okay, Dragon yeah, Rage. Yeah, there spell. it is. Remorseless Winter? Yeah, I think that's w like a DK spell, but I don't remember. Uh, uh, winter... Yeah, no, I think it's just missing, actually. Could be. Could I mean, be. I had, the... so far, every spell I wanted to track. But if you don't find it, you obviously DM Grim really quickly. I mean, that is kind of what we do. You know, if you want a certain spell added, you can either post it in our Discord, mm -hmm. or you can make a comment on the... What you might call it? On the CurseForge uh, page of the add-on itself. Mm -hmm. And we just do our thing. There's quite a lot of them. Yeah, if not, they will get added immediately. And yeah, keep in mind there is quite a lot of them, and they got curated by uh, Echo Raid team, which I can tell you some of them. I don't even know why they're there, but they are because people wanted to track. So the other cool thing, yeah, this is going to be hashtag ad, but unironically. Downloading from CurseForge actually helps the developers because they actually get some kickback from the ads. So when you use it, you actually help the people who make all of these glorious things that make the game playable. How much is that That's realistically? It. Like, is there data that can, can be like shown? Like, how much can like I don't know, big wigs get, or like Vcar? How much is Vcar is making? You think? Like, is there an estimate? Is it I, like I confidential? No. I mean, you would need someone who has like a big add-on. You could ask Nogi that because he has like uh, uh, Mythic Dungeon tools. Yeah, right? I don't know if he's allowed has, to like, tell though. It might be like yeah, I, I'm not sure. But the majority of sure the ad revenue goes to the creators, guys. And there's like one small ad on the corner somewhere. It doesn't do anything else except uh, oh, what? Do you know what just happened? What? Like this moment? Oh, I opened CurseForge. What happened? It got approved. Yes. As soon, as soon as you opened the Holy shit. Curseforge, it got approved. The oh, perfect boys. timing. That means the people can get it timing. now. Correct. That is. Oh, let's correct. go, boys. Let's click the panel and get it really quickly. You can also... Wait, wait. Wick, yoink. Curse forge. There you go. Yeah, get it from fine. that link, boys. Just a quick yoink. And look for Echo Ray tools. Exactly. 
should be there. I like yeah. to actually check on my app. This is the small ad we were talking about, by the way. I don't think they have ads yeah. for Turkey ever. Like I've maybe seen only one ad. Oh, even yeah, Christmas decoration. Be. Oh, dude, the Christmas decoration is shaking. Look at this, the bells. Wait, what? Wait, can you guys hear this? Oh yeah, it actually is. You can click the them? Yeah, it makes a sound. Oh, it's each a different tone as well. You could play a song here, dude, if you're really quick. Now we're pushing. Yeah, Cursor has it all, boys. Okay, okay, please drive your trigger my OCD really badly. Press the update all button. God. Oh, yeah. I'll. I don't know, man. I mean, it's like, it's on. working fine right now. You know, I. This is the thing with me. I I don't like to change a working system. Oh. That's fine. I think we keep it like this. Oh, my. Chat, make him do it, please. Uh, I'm actually scared because my uh, internet is so bad. Wait, let's let's try to up, update one add-on and see if uh, I lag. I didn't lag at all. Fuck, let's go. Oh, I was scared though. Okay, my internet was unstable at some point where when I up like download anything, it would lag me out. But okay, it's fine. interesting. Dude, for a second, I thought you lagged out because you were not moving your head. I was like, fuck, I DC'd there. No, it's good. Everything is fine. We didn't DC. Yeah. My internet no. is fixed. No, do yeah. you know what we do now? Now you yeah. reload UI and see what happens. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Have that's uh, I feel like I'm getting intubated here, but uh, let's do it, dude. Please, game. This is not a curse rush problem. Uh, Blizzard, sometimes when you update add ons, it uh, leads to some bugs. Like just because a new version of add-ons has bad code and then it destroys your whole UI, but we're safe. Oh, oh why? My heart is actually the beat there. safe. Yeah, we are safe. And the cooldown is still safe. there. Attack. Yeah, and everything's still there. It's up, it's up, it's up. Right, now we're good. Yeah, mm -hmm. there are a few things that are coming in real, really soon future, and I don't mean Blizzard soon. I mean actually. Yeah. So the first thing that we want to add. To this system is a convenient way to export groups and um, filters so you can share it with your friends or your sub ui for twitch prime but uh the way we want to do it we want to do it like in a really nice way so it's taking a bit longer than anticipated let's put it that way okay so that's coming really soon and the profile exporting that... and importing yeah. yeah, exactly. Okay. But it's not all, because the way we designed the add on ah, is that you yeah. have these modules. Yeah. Yeah. The way we designed it, you have these modules, right? But we obviously want to, by default, support exporting of everything, right? Like as soon as we add a new feature that may or may not be, you know, notes on steroids for raids. Oh. Uh, oh. This one. We want to be able. To, yeah, exactly. But we also want basically to export those settings as well, right? So we want to implement it in a way where our exporting supports like incremental export of all the settings, not just like, you know, a random thing here. And there. So that's the first feature that is coming. After that, we will probably release the assignment. The automatic assignments? Or, oh, no. The, oh, no. what? No. That one. I think we got to talk about it. I think that's way too uh, high tech. I, I think the... Competitive. Yeah, I, I don't, don't think, think the people need it. The community does not need it. It's just way too high tech. It's basically yeah, the, the thing that allows those guys, like let's say we have the jailer bombs, right? It's the thing that allows us to say, because my general assignment in the position is over here, that I should be likelier to get the bomb that goes to blue, green, diamond, and then moon, cross, star. So I, I will never go to star basically is what it does. Whereas if your position is over here, it sets a priority that this guy over here it will likely go to moon or star and then cross and then blue or something. It's really high tech and only necessary on very difficult fights. Um, I think the only good side effect of bringing that out would be that uh, our recars would work for everybody without any adjustment yes. necessary. Yeah, I, I understand that, but I think the um, casual uh, Twitch chat. I think it's for them too high complexity is is what I think. Sure. Let's let's get other features instead for everyone. Sure. Sure. Yeah. Well, there is a feature that we kind of want to do, but yeah, I didn't even tell you about. 
So, okay. You know how PvP is like a thing, right? Yeah, it's, it's getting it a lot of viewers now as well on Twitch. Yeah, yeah, it, it also exists, right? Like, uh, yeah, wild. it does exist, yeah. But what I did notice in PvP is that most of people are playing with um, basically stock UI there, right? Like, there's not really any tech there. So we thought about something. You want to ruin PvP? Would... Okay. Yes, basically. Because yeah. in PvP, for some reason, um, our glorious Blizzard does allow friendly nameplates to be modified in combat. No. Yes. Guys, run. He's coming. Yeah. No, <laughs> you don't we want We might that. ruin PvP. No, I think that's going to get hot fixed. PvP. I think we should, like, if you attempt to do something for it, I think we should talk to Blizzard first, because I think they're just going to say, nah, this is too much. We just ban Wait, this. You don't want to play PvP in a way where the plays itself? Just follow uh, the lead. I mean, I would like to, of course. That's why I play WoW. I don't want to play it. I mean, prime exactly. example, I'm outside radiating. But uh, I think they will, like, I think they will literally fix it. I think the only reason that that's allowed is because people... Nobody it, uses it. Yeah, for some Basically. people, like for some reason, like PvP is like still Stone Age times. Yeah. I think I don't know why, but I think they just refuse to update their add-on. I think they like rely too much on their pure talent instead of uh, like using like Augmenting tools. It. Yeah, it's like punching a tree to like knock it down. You get really strong fists, but like it's really dumb, right? Just use an axe. Yeah. Yeah. Correct. Correct. PvP players, we all know, I don't they're know. great. Yeah, one of these days. Yeah, but one of these days we might win. Decorators. Okay, sure. You, cool. You're cutting out a bit, by the way, but it's fine. I understand. Oh, we might ruin them. Yeah. Cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's that's the thing that might happen or might not depends uh, on certain things. Yes. But mm -hmm. the thing that's also coming out really really soon is like the note module that I mentioned. It's yeah. basically going to be similar to the current note, but it's going to be a lot more user friendly. Let's put it that way. So the, one of the main features that I'm going to tease is instead of having this like one gigantic note, you will have like a way to split up uh, a note into multiple pages. Yeah, that's right? good. And then yeah. you can, and then you can figure out what you want to display, what you don't want to display. When you say blah. multiple pages, like you mean I can have a note here and I can have another note over here? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yes. that's good. Yeah. Yeah. And you can decide what you want to show, what you don't want to show. Yeah. All sorts of that things. It will support. It's pretty cool. It's basically like half of the code is already in it in Decorate Tools. So you can sneak a peek. If you have some knowledge, you can actually look at it, how it works now. Yeah, very but, cool. Just, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, but that should also come relatively soon. But, oh, okay. Yeah, that is pretty much it for this time around. For now, by the way, like oh. the, la the only reason I'm using Exodus Ray Tools at this point is uh, notes. Yeah, I I'm not using anything else. Yeah. Uh, oh, there are small so features I coming think there really is soon. Rate inspect is good. I don't have it right now. Yeah, but... that. Yeah, I mean that's kind of with the way we're doing the cooldowns. Rate inspect kind of becomes just build a UI for it forehead. So that might come really soon as well. It's like a weekend ah, project. So. Sorry, I, I don't mean actually, sorry, no, not rate inspect as in uh, checking their items and stuff. I, I've never used this actually. Food flask. Yeah, food stuff. flask. And the bad part with yeah. that is like it needs to be maintained with every patch with new foods and new flasks and stuff. I mean, that's not, there's not that many. Yeah, it's things not, there. Like, it's not yeah, like cool. It just needs to be done. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, this? yeah. Anyways, that's pretty much it. But what I'd like chat to do, if you have any issues, bugs, feature, like quality of life things you'd like to see, just either use the Discord. We have a dedicated channel for that in our Echo Discord, Acclamation Discord. Yeah. Uh, or you can use the CurseForge page directly and post a comment on there. Search page. So. Yeah, wait, this is the CurseForge page, page as well. Uh, I wrote in a second. Curse. There you go. I mean, I think actually, if we just do. Sneeze, no. but I couldn't. Damn it. Haha, -ha, there it is. Oh, there we go. And yeah, you can also post a comment directly there, and I'll see it. And we will definitely. Oh, we need to update the UI. But yeah. 
But that's pretty much it. Master called what? Uh, let's let's <laughs> don't ask questions you don't want okay, to answer. Okay, okay, I'm good. But yeah, that is There's already quite pretty... a lot of feedback in the past, but now yeah. new version. Yeah, this is yeah. going to be more relevant to look at. All right, that's yeah, it. Exactly. Yeah, that this was good. It. Any yeah. questions before Grim leaves chat? Or maybe like a cry for help that you really need a feature or something. Are there fields to enter number for opacity slash colors so people can have them all even and not slightly different by using the mouse? Yeah, of course. Oh, yeah, yeah. Echo RT. Yeah, I think I could have entered everything there. Like here. I mean, you can enter. Here you can. Oh, can you? Can... Oh, you have the plus here. But I think this was quite easy to do. Like the plus minus. And then uh, here, oh, it's a big yeah, number. Yeah, the thing that he's talking thing. about is specifically color, right? Well, color is a special one, right? Because the, the reason you have color picker plus, like, right? Like an add-on? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I think you I do. don't. I don't have this an add-on like, like this. I think well, this, like, obviously. I don't know, this is like the Vicara thing. All right. Yeah, it's all using the oh, same thing. Oh, it's LVI. My man, this is why yeah. I use LVI, man. Nah, okay, I'm, I'm linking something. This Literally, is I'm not using anything like uh, like that is non-quality of life with LVI. Like combat-wise, nothing that That's is in my combat is shown, like done by LVI. But this quality of life shit is perfect. Okay, first thing, open your curse watch. We're going to fix your life right now because this is horrendous. I noticed oh. something was bothering me. Do it. What? Yeah. Go to get more add-ons. All right. Color picker plus. Color picker plus. Install. install it that's how easy yeah, it is with cursor and then reload i'm already done have you ever yeah, installed an add-on this quickly fast. i don't think it's possible at the same time i, I supported color pickup plus by doing this like i made it worth for that person to have done this add-on i don't even know what it is yet yeah what next echo RT. now try to open Attack. try to open one of the color stuff uh display done oh, what is this uh no nah. Yeah. Now, this is the thing why it's so good. Do you see that copy button? There? Ah, yeah, so, that's look, good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then you can paste them permanently. It's so nice. Just use Color Picker Plus and save your life forever. Trust. Ah, there, there was a question in chat regarding uh, how easy it's going to be, uh, how, how easy it's going to be to integrate weak orders with notes feature coming with the cooldowns, right? Funny thing is, with the notes and Echo uh, cooldowns already supports, uh, already has an API that allows you to just ask it, hey, give me all immunity that are available. It's just going to give you a table with all the glorious immunities in there. Mm -hmm. But note module will also support, I don't know if you saw, but our notes look at this way. You see this hashtag int and the numbers and something, right? Yeah. It's going to support that type of parsing by default so you're just gonna in week or as you can say hey give me the current note and it's just gonna give you some data to be able to read the note without actually reading the note so primarily these things are implemented because it makes our lives easier during the race but i can also see how it can be helpful for other people so we just we are just going to release it yeah so, so what we might need to do is some sort of like uh base vicara though that people can yeah uh, like an example we could have yeah exactly for like reminders yeah. i think that's what they what you mean right uh uh tanner that you can like at 50 seconds into the fight devo ocean aura uh picture pops up or bar or something because it says in the note with some formatting that yeah that's that 40 seconds to do, yeah yeah okay mm -hmm. that's simple to do yeah yeah um, i think that's something that a lot of people use mm-hmm it's a good as well. Yeah. Yeah. That shouldn't be a big problem. And the cool thing is, because we're going to have, like, with our notes, there's going to be, um, there's going to be notes, and you can also have a personal note. So even if your raid leader puts something gibberish in the note that you don't care about, you can still set up your own personal note that triggers those reminders. So... Uh -huh. Also yeah, on a different page be, that you don't need to see everything. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. You, you can also hide the page. So you can just use it as a configuration thing. 
apparently we don't have anything that tells us how to open the menu by the way like slash echo rt it's not in the cursor oh. page true i will edit that right now we're gonna fix this that's true how are people oh, dude imagine downloading this it has 57k downloads by the way that's a lot yeah it does have quite a bit didn't expect that i yeah damn imagine with all the new features is in like uh three months goal is to get it to 200k let's go yeah, i mean maybe doable uh doable. yeah so it's slash echo rt guys uh we are going where do i put this this bay we do it here i installed it but don't work hmm. that's a bit uh unspecific that, that's, uh, yeah i need a bit more that. more data what does not work sir one question how do we support grim and his efforts is there a donate tab or something no we uh you just download it through curseforge and that's how you support it this whole thing is sponsored by curseforge and when you use curseforge you automatically already support your creators you don't you don't i mean Correct. if you can go above and beyond and go to like a patreon or something but uh, we don't have one for this because this is you know the curseforge support is more than enough there you go page has been edited yeah can i start on setting or anything did you reload it after downloading that's a thing that people might miss just something slash reloading game don't forget guys like it should show up in your add-on list when you look at it yeah tools yeah i just tried it with no add-ons loaded and it worked fine it's version 0 0.8 by the way this is not even version one like we're just nah, getting started not. yeah it's 0 0.8.1 yeah. that version is wrong there because um you didn't restart your game so it's always reading the but oh what version is it's it now? 0 0.9 0 0.9 1 i think ah, okay or, or, yeah still it, it doesn't one. matter it's definitely not even close to one one it does work with LUI. Glorious. Yeah, I do have LUI. Yeah. Is there a way to remove certain elements? Yeah, you need you need to update it, guys. By the way, if you didn't update it, this is like a new thing. The part in the yeah. past, you only had the journal. So when you go here, you see the uh, echo icon on like jailer rate and stuff. I don't even know if you see it here, but you have to update it to get all the good stuff now. Can't wait for 10.0. <laughs> Jesus, at that point, uh, it's a whole like game. You don't play wow you play echo ray tools yeah you can have like you can have that. like rates implemented in the game as practice you know that practice you tool game to you could have that in you the game dude that would be sick actually like the x practice implemented into echo ray tools for every boss so that you can practice it without even pulling you can just like go attack ray tools open fight yes i want to practice uh i don't know brute keeper egg kiting oh that would be sick dude holy shit, people would love it Yeah, great. For that one, we would need a great. Patreon. Great. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 But in general, that is it for this. You see this? Can you get the weak order to play my character for me? Fun thing, that was actually possible in this patch. We just didn't do it. I didn't even tell the scribe because I was scared. What you're gonna do with that yeah that's good i mean we won it's fine i forgive you okay then, then then we're fine then we're fine but yeah that is pretty much it for from me there's not any other question food time food time yeah all right have yeah. Uh, have a nice food dude i will thank you for the presentation grim and uh, for the nice add-on you brought us but why is all my well, uh, interrupts right now white? I'm not AFK. Oh, because I because I no because I set it to white. 
because I was testing the color picker. Oh. Never mind. It's all good. That will do it. That will do it. Uh, I think, at least. Yeah, well, let's find out. Uh, interrupts. Bar color Bar settings. Color. Yeah. Yeah, put it on use class. Use class. All right. Yeah, we're good. That's fine. Okay, so user error. User okay, error. I'm happy about that one. I'm good, I'm good. Anyways, keep in mind, I'm not the only one that's working on this. There's two other people that are doing, let's be honest, most of the work, and I'm just there to lead the way. So, big who are these people? To those two who are, I, mean, I don't know if they want to get mentioned, so I'm going to ah, skip okay. that. Yeah, true. Yeah. Okay. But yeah. we, it's kind of funny that the only person we mentioned is Grim, who's doing the least work, but with the excuse exactly. that uh, yeah, they Yoink. might not want to get mentioned. It's interesting. Yeah, yeah. Yoink. Okay. My nice. work now. Easy. You know? That's how it works usually. There you go, guys. Hashtag sponsored. Yeah. Exactly. All right. Anyways. Well, yeah, thank you for the chat and the explanations. Yeah. Thank you for having me. All right. Bye-bye, dude. Yeah. Bye.